Okay guys, remember this that I picked up yesterday? Well, I just found another one at my local Aldi. This other one that I found yesterday was from the one out of town. Also, same dumpster. Don't know what kind of condition it's in. But I got this 10 foot offset umbrella, which will look very nice. Now you see the picture? I know it's upside down, but you see the chairs they're sitting in? Well, yep, I've got one that I bought, one that I found in the dumpster that I'm going to repair, the little slash marks where they cut it. And also, at the Ollie's, someone uh, put their personal stuff in, and I have got what looks to be a really nice uh, golf bag. I'm going to pull this sucker out. Because it actually has golf clubs in it, and I didn't look to see what they look like. I don't know how this opens up. Oh my god, golf clubs? <laughs> see if you can open that up. I'm filming it to show the people. And here is the daddy man trying to get this open. Hello. <laughs> uh, somebody dumped their personal stuff. Have um, seen? I think this comes off here, sweetie. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't think that does it. No, see, this. Right, fine. Let's yeah, just... try that, because then it should slip off the top. And then we'll see what we've got here. A full set of gold clubs. And I figured um, if we couldn't sell them, we could donate them. Let's have a little look here. You've got a three iron, a five iron, a six iron, an eight iron, a number one wood, two number one woods, one's an oversized, and it's a Wilson. That's a very reputable make. A number three iron, if I didn't already mention that, two six irons. Actually, that's a, that's a, that's a sand wedge. Okay. Or, or something of that like. There's his putter. It is a full... Um, if you owned this set of golf clubs, you wouldn't need to buy any other golf clubs. Well, we'll have to, we'll have to have that checked out and see how much that's worth. You know, call the experts. Yeah, don't call me because I'm no expert. <laughs> so you've got a pitch and putt. You've got a pitcher. You've got a sand wedge. You've got a really nice titanium um, made by Wilson wood. Shafts look good, they look straight. Um, grips look good. And um, and the bag looks to be in really good shape, does it not? The bag's dusty. Well, it was in the dumpster. Uh, the golf club in there. There's um, another golf club in there. Neither of which I would recommend wearing because you don't know whether the person had uh, a skin condition or not. And there's a ball. There's a ball. Yeah, having a ball here, a floating mother's... Um, unzip this one, one side down here, babe, and see what's in there. What? There? What? Hang yeah. On. Anything in there? Yes. What? Dust? A, a gap. A gap. All right, then. Do you see what else I got? Another one of those. I thought, I thought, um, we'd the have a matching set. umbrella. Yeah. A 10 foot offset umbrella that has been thrown away, so it, it's more than likely to be in very well, condition, but never mind. But maybe you can fix it. I can fix most things. That's, I usually do. That's the point. <laughs> it's rude to point. <laughs> All right, have a good day, guys. If you haven't already, please do like and subscribe. Like. Hi, guys. I know it's a little dark. Hopefully you can see. There's my umbrella. And um, there's the box that I picked up this evening. Absolutely nothing wrong with it. Couldn't find, uh, I think there was one tiny little crack. Now that first one I got, there's a few cracks and uh, my husband is gonna do some engineering and, and make it you know, sturdy, fix it up. This one, there was one tiny little crack 
nothing that hindered it working. Um, it didn't have its box and that was all fine and it's just in perfect shape. Now the umbrella, the reason why they returned it apparently are these pieces of the base. It's two of the same pieces so they don't cross together to make the bottom to hold it up. So the daddy man got some scrap pieces of wood and a little engineering and he built a base for me and that's why it's dark is he's just got it finished and so here i am we got that sand for free as well next to a dumpster Shh. he said oh we'll we'll need some sandbags to put under them and i said oh i know what dumpster those are at <laughs> and off we went so there we go, there's the sandbags to hold it in place. I've got my new chair. I haven't quite fixed my, my one that was slashed and, and bent yet, but I've got my new one sitting under it. And so that's the pin right there. I put my little Yorkies in the pin so they can't run away. And I sit right here and read in my driveway. So um, not at all bad for free. <laughs> we like free, don't we? Have a good day, guys.